get slim arms with easy lifestyle changes. Worrying about arms that are too thick or floppy isn't anything new. In order to get slim arms for once and for all, here are some exercises that you can try to help slim down your arms. Body fat reduces as a whole, not in a certain area. This means that burning fat to get slim arms is only possible through reducing body fat in the entire body. Extremely important, toning these exercises serve to tone and firm up the body. In addition, they also substitute fat with muscle mass. Toning the body doesn't mean gaining new muscle mass. It's a state in which resting muscles attain a base tone different from they normally would. When a body is toned, it stays firm. Muscles are able to passively and continuously stay partially contracted. If muscles can be toned, it can lessen body fat and even reduce their volume. Reducing fat, little by little we want to aim for slowly reducing body fat. When body fat is burned quickly, arms tend to stay flabby. This occurs because a big part of the weight loss comes from water and muscle mass. Reducing or burning fat implies consistency. In order to get slim arms, we need to have a discipline that keeps the body balanced in a sustainable manner. A proper diet following a proper diet is a huge factor in reducing body fat. This diet should be paired with an exercise routine that tones the body. In addition to not leaving you feeling hungry, a proper diet won't have you thinking about losing weight constantly. You should do exercises that work the entire body, in addition to specific exercises for your arms. Toning the entire body will slightly increase muscle mass which will lead to a faster metabolism. Unlike fat, muscles require energy. Fat is actually stored as an energy reserve. Exercises that target your arms should be paired with cardiovascular exercises. Together, they become more effective for burning calories and provide many health benefits. How long should we exercise for? In order to make exercises the most effective and to burn calories efficiently, exercises should last for no less than 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, the body eliminates fat and it has a direct impact if you want to get slim arms. The exercises don't have to be high impact. Exercises to get slim arms for the biceps using light weights, it's possible to exercise anywhere. These exercises are good for home or at work. If you don't have weights handy, there's no need to worry, a pair of 500 milliliters water bottles is all you need to get slim arms. Join your elbows and lift the weights, or the water bottles, up to the height of your shoulders. Repeat 15 times and rest for a couple seconds before repeating the set 10 times. For the shoulders and the entire arm stretch your arms so that they are parallel to the ground. Extend them completely and move them in a circular motion. Keep your abdomen contracted during this movement. Move them in one direction for one minute, and after in the other direction for one minute. 
it's important to take short breaks. The aim of this exercise is to train the body to a new routine, not to tire it out. For the triceps in order to lightly develop the triceps, try this simple exercise, lift your arms. Your elbows should be held higher than the height of your head. After, hold up a 1.5 bottle of water with both hands. Bend your arms behind you. Repeat this action 15 times and rest briefly. All of these exercises should be practiced consistently. Perseverance is very important and results will follow with time. Slimming your arms is great because it implies getting your whole body moving. This won't only lead to slimming down your arms, but rather, your whole body will be better off. Eating smaller portions, including salads, going out for walks and doing light exercise is fundamental. All of these activities should be accompanied by activities that keep arms in light tension. Dieting or exercising too much is ill-advised. Forcing the body can lead to injuries and a diet that's too strict is easy to break. The best way is seeking the perfect amount of both. Featured image courtesy of copyrightwikihow.com.